الرحمن الرحيم Greetings and welcome to DIY Woodworking TV. Yes, uh, our DIY Woodworking is getting popular and uh, I'm getting clients. So I have my home client right here, Arish, and another client, Hadi, Abdul Hadi is upstairs, and the third client is Mummy. So we have three orders today for woodworking. Yippee! Uh, for kids, it's a little bit complicated because we need to match the color of the plywood that we have used on their study table. So it's going to be easy. I'm just going to cut some pieces and, you know, make an organizer for them. But they want bamboo. Go find some bamboo. We're going to use the bamboos as uh, pencil and pen holders and also one of the bamboo tubes for a bit of little things holder and then one piece of box. So let's get to the designing first and then we'll take it from there. Once again, we started with a simple drawing. I drew a simple idea for Arish to see because he is working with me on this project and we are building this together. So his ideas are very important to me. After the drawing was approved by Arish, I went ahead and ripped some pieces of uh, the agreed size from the plywood that we wanted to match the color with of uh, the study desk we built previously. It was an easy task to just uh, shave a little bit of the uh, you know shiny and uh, slippery area of uh, plywood and then glue the pieces and add bread nails which made the frame very easy and we built the frame quickly in no time at all. Once the frame was ready, it was time to decide about the bamboo part. nice but it's slightly cleaner cut than this one and much more straight compared to this one hey I'm getting good with my hands off After the bamboos were cut to the desired shapes, I went ahead with my Dremel tool using a small drum sander on it and shaved all the excess parts and the sharp uh, edges of the bamboo. Then I used a simple polisher on it and polished the surfaces of bamboo that was really dirty and getting wide because they always sit in this dusty environment. After doing this, bamboos were ready for the epoxy resin job. So it doesn't escape, all right? Come on, do it. So we will cover every scape possible for the resin and hope that it doesn't escape. After that, we'll make resin, put the bamboos here and put resin in. It will be amazingly beautiful, inshallah. 
As we learned from our previous experiences that Raisin loves escaping from every little hole, so we did our best this time. I and Arish hot glued all the areas around these frames and we put a very nice and thin plastic sheet under that so that it will be easier for us to remove it should we want to polish the base later. After that we poured in the epoxy resin and added the yellow, oh sorry, the blue color. Oh, am I going uh, colorblind here? <laughs> so we added a blue color which will later form a very beautiful shape all by itself. After that, all we had to do was wait for 48 hours for epoxy resin to dry and our masterpieces will be ready. This one is Arish's. Mm -hmm. and is I that... have sticky notes here and two rulers and one eraser and one more sticky notes and many pens. The bamboo top is Arish's design. He didn't want to waste the cut piece. So once we cut the taper cut, he wanted this piece to be like on. This. And Hadis is tapered cut. And he has a lot of things already here. You can also see our epoxy raisin job. And here we have a golden raisin and a clear raisin with a little bit of blue. It looks like a broken ice or, you know, <laughs> frozen one breaking ice. Look good, not bad. And one more thing we learned was to coat the top with the epoxy resin and it makes it really very smooth, smooth very very smooth yeah smooth and shiny it drank the gum yeah it drank all the epoxy epoxy loves you know resin actually loves escaping so this is this now they can use their organizers then here will be a whiteboard probably and top they have their new floating shelf which we already have a video about go check it out enjoy and more videos are coming very soon right what's next mm, the next is the gun holder gun holder here and tomorrow what will be ready the lego table the lego table